Bon, if you could, could you give us your your name and title and uh, title with SGIP, and then a little bit about what you do with SGIP. I'm John McDonald, and with the uh, SGIP means Smart Grid Interoperability Panel, and I'm uh, the chairman of the board of SGIP 2.0, uh, which is the, the new member-funded model of SGIP. Mm -hmm. So what are um, the benefits to members of SGIP? What are the, what are the general benefits for membership? Yeah, that's benefits uh, per, of participation, you know, in SGIP is extremely important today because in the first uh, two or three years when we were government funded, there was no fee to participate. And now that we're member funded uh, and um, organizations are paying dues, very important for us to um, clearly articulate right what the benefits are so we we look at the benefits three ways you know one way would be um, the individual that participates what's the benefit to the individual okay, I mean, the individual learns a lot about the technology learns a lot about what the comp competition is doing learns a lot about the trends in the marketplace when you're when you're doing standards work okay and then the individual's organization benefits because that individual brings back to the organization relevant, timely information that then um, is used in the strategy, the development of product, or for utilities, the framing of projects that they need to do. And so the organization benefits. And then the third level is the benefits to the industry in general. I mean, we, you know, we. Um, with SGIP, the, the ultimate benefit is that we advance, we accelerate standards, we accelerate the, the interoperability of technology, which benefits everybody. Now, John, you're not only the chairman of the board with SGIP, you also work with GE, who's a member. Can you tell me a little bit about how your association and membership with SGIP has helped benefited the work benefit the work that you've done with GE? Sure. Um, so I'm, uh, the business that I'm in at GE is called Digital Energy. It's within um, Energy Management, which reports directly to the CEO of GE. So uh, Energy Management is four businesses. We're one of those four businesses, but our four businesses go directly to the CEO. So we're, we're fairly visible within, within all of GE. And my role has three parts. It's um, technical strategy of the business, so cutting across uh, all the product lines, you know, in terms of strategy. Two is industry standards, which is very well aligned, you know, with the smart grid interoperability panel work. And three is policy development. Um, and uh, you know, we say that uh, success of smart grid is has three parts: technology, standards, and policy. So it's important that uh, those three have equal weight and that they're uh, and they're also interdependent with each other. So um, what's important is that those three uh, I have the responsibility for. So one person has responsibility for all three. Um, so we, we found that um, um, standards greatly impact what we do at GE. You know, I mean we we want to make sure when we develop technology that we're aware of what the industry standards are that would impact that technology, and um, or on the other hand, better yet, if we if we lead the standards work, we can influence standards work where it would be strategic to what we do at GE, you know.